As I said before, you can have a lot of fun with your blowgun. In inclement weather, you can shoot it inside, you can shoot it in the basement, uh, you can shoot it in the, the den or the rumpus room, uh, you can go to the drugstore or the dollar store and get all kinds of fun little toys that you can play with. Uh, here we have some tiny uh, bowling pins I bought at the drugstore, and you can actually make up games that you can play with your family or your kids. Um, the stun dart's a lot of fun. Uh, here we're going to have a, a little bowling game, and the winner is the one that clears all the pins with the fewest amount of shots. And I guess I win in two shots. Try to beat me at home. Puts quite a smack on a soda tin. As many of you know, I like to hunt. When you have a 625 Magnum blowgun, some sun darts, and some little plastic animals, you can hunt in the comfort of your own living room. Here's what I mean. And there you have it. I cleared the decks, had a great time hunting, in the safety and comfort of my own gym. The next time you find yourself at home on a rainy day with a house full of kids, go on a dinosaur hunt with your 625 Magnum. You'll all have a lot of fun. If the 625 Magnum had been around eons ago, the dinosaurs would have gone extinct a lot sooner. If you like to smash and break things as much as I do, you're going to love stun darts through this 625 Magnum. I've got some candy wafers out here on my target board, and I'm going to show you what you can do. It's a lot of fun. There you have it. A lot of destruction, but no harm done. One of the often overlooked um, aspects of our 625 Magnum blowgun is its usefulness as an impact tool in a self-defense emergency. This blowgun I have here in my hands is four feet long. It's lightweight, super fast, and gives tremendous reach. Um, it'll outreach almost any other weapon uh, an opponent might have in his hands and give you a real advantage if you're forced to defend yourself with it. Um, this blowgun is made, as I've mentioned earlier, out of aircraft grade aluminum. It's about one and a half millimeters thick, and it's pretty darn tough, what you're going to see. Now I'm going to demonstrate in full speed and full power what our blowgun is capable of when used as an impact tool. As you can see, I hit that pell pretty hard. I bent my blowgun tube a little bit, but it's still perfectly serviceable. I could take out five or six more opponents with this and still not damage it. 